afternoon baseball here on the show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the Boston Red Sox. The Red Sox look to end this three-game interleague series with a sweep next. Now to the plate, Gerald Hayden. First chance for him here after appearing as a pinch hitter in the game last night. Pitch on the way. To first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Digging in, Pablo Reyes. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Ornelas gets his lead at first, nobody out. Hit to third, five. To second for one, on to first, and they turn the double play. Bottom of the third now, and standing in is the veteran third baseman, Gerald Hayden. Gerald Hayden. First pitch of the at bat. Uh, no plate discipline that time, and he's in the hole now, 0-2. Today's contest is, of course, the finale of the series, and the home side has dominated so far. They've got the opportunity to complete the sweep with a win in this one. These teams don't match up all that often, but due to interleague, they get a chance to play this season, and it's really difficult to sweep a team in a three-game series. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. Unbelievable! A home run! I don't believe what I just saw! I don't believe what I just saw! Solo shot to right center. Home run number five on the year as the Red Sox break on top now five to nothing. I know height sight's 20-20, but you can't throw that pitch to that guy. Don't forget, he homered yesterday, so you know he's locked in and ready to roll up there. We'll see if he learns from that mistake. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And next will be the switch hitting third baseman, Gerald Hayden. Even though they're up by a boatload early on in this one, you can't get complacent and get lazy. They got to keep the gas pedal down because this team that they're playing can strike and score a lot of runs too. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. High fly ball out to deep right field. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Stepping in, Gerald Hayden. He flew out in his last at-bat. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last A.B. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this A.B. Hazley is back, and he'll get there to make the play for route number two. At the plate, Adam Hazley. He's working now on a one for three, three thus far. Adam Hazley. A swing and a ground ball to third. Fielded. On to first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball. Into the box now, That's Gerald right. Hayden. He'll swing it from the left side right here. And this is the side of the plate this guy loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left-handed, hitting against right-handed pitching. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Ornelas is underneath this one. And there's the second out of the inning. Wow, what a week for these guys. Talk about firing on all cylinders. Winners of an amazing seven games in a row. They say to never question the streak, and these guys aren't. 
They're just enjoying this ride. 10 to 1, the final lopsided score in this ball game. The Boston Red Sox took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. George Kirby takes the win on the mound, his second of the year. Brian Prado allowed seven earned runs to cross the plate in the losing effort. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.